All right, 550 John Martin hitting the slopes again this morning. And right now he is live and waking up in Winter Park where ski season starts today. Good morning, John. Hey, good morning. Is it acceptable to eat a 12 inch Snickers with a knife and a fork? Like Will Seinfeld? You still go. It, it, be careful. Okay. Hey, yeah, it's Jillian Anderson from SoCo CW. I'm John from Fox 21. We are teaming up to hit Winter Park for opening day. One of the other things we did here, we went down to where? Okay, the Devil's, Devil's Thumb. Thumb Spa Ranch Resort. Spa Ranch. I don't Is know. Is it a spa, a ranch, or a resort? It, it has all of them. All of them. All three. All of them. That's yeah. a lot of names. And in this instance, we went to go check out the ranch aspect of it with some beautiful, gigantic, hard-working horses. I need to step up. So now as the Devil's Thumb um, Ranch Resort and Spa, we're, we're ranching it now with Anthony, who is in control of very large horses. What's happening here, Anthony? So right now we are hooking up to go feed. This is uh, one of our smaller feed sleighs that we use when we don't have guest activities and things like that. So what Tony and Bo here are going to do today is take out this uh, bale of hay. weighs about 1,100 pounds. They are very valuable to me. These teams are the only way that we can actually uh, feed our horses throughout the winter once the snow dip kind of uh, gets to a certain point that the equipment has too much of a trouble getting out there. Interesting. So uh, what Jessie's going to do right now, she's going to hook up our tongue and that's actually what the horses use to pull our load. Everything with the harness is made to make this bearing of the weight a lot easier. So. The uh, combination strap here is what the tongue will hook up to. These are called hames. The hames is what's going to bear the weight, and that's how they're going to pull this out for me here. And so it's interesting you're saying that when the hey. machines can't handle the, the depth of the snow, the horses can. Yeah. So yep. when machinery cuts out, okay. these guys are doing it. Yep. Wow. So these guys, uh, I will tell you what right now, true horsepower. Beats any kind of machine horsepower any day of the week. Uh, there's a really neat YouTube video actually. That sh uh, there was, uh, I think it was back east in the northeast there, and uh, there was a big tractor trailer that got stuck, ran off the side of the road in a big snowstorm, and uh, there was actually a four-horse team that pulled him out of the ditch. Wow! So uh, whenever the machines can't do it, we've always got these to lay back on. Now our ranch. We have a, kind of a, a very unique situation because we are one of the only ranches in the area that keep a herd of horses up throughout the winter time. Okay. And uh, these guys work mainly throughout the winter. This is their main season to work because they have to feed those guys for us. So we work it out to about 3% of the horse's body weight per day to help them keep their calorie intake up so that they're you know, staying healthy and things like that. So uh, with the hay bale that we have on back right here, that equals to about 36 pounds per horse per day. Goodness gracious. All right, well, let's see these bad boys in action. You got it. All right, guys, we're going to come right straight for you there. <laughs> Team, step Mike, over. they weigh about 2,000 pounds step each. Over. <laughs> step over. Team, step up. Well, that is quite remarkable. Look at that go. Devil Thumb Ranch Resort and Spa. And I am not a horse whisperer, but from the looks of it, they, they, they really enjoy doing the work. You said they were loving it. They were, I mean, like when the snow was out and they finally got let out into the snow, they were frolicking. Byron got some shots. They're like rolling on their back, just enjoying it. And they want to work. They want to pull. Like they want to, again, I don't, I don't talk with them. But you sensed it. But I sensed it about them. And yeah. they probably knew there was food coming at the end. And that's also very true. Yes, <laughs> they get rewarded for it. Yeah, so that's Devil's Thumb um, Ranch spa. Resort spa? and Spa. What? Spa Resort. We'll get spa. that worked out for the next time we re this. All three words are in that title, though. That's, yeah. For sure. Uh, and then coming up a little bit later in the next hour, guys, we're going to show you the hard work that goes on to get Winter Park ready. Uh, for their opening here at 9 a.m. this morning. A lot of new technology this year, so you're not having to fumble for your ticket to make sure you go up on the lift. Uh, they got the, the Disney like Fast Pass thing going on. Um, getting the mountains groomed. It, it's, it's quite remarkable how much work goes into it, and uh, we're going to show you that and hang out for a little bit. Sounds good. Very nice. Thanks, John. Look